Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new then hi, my name is Caitlin. Welcome and today I'm doing another repressing video. I have three little projects to do today and I'm really really excited uh, but also just before we jump into the video if my audio is a little bit worse or different my hundred pound mic that I got two months ago decided to just die on me. Uh, I'm not happy. Blue Yeti what is your problem? So today I've had to go out and buy like a really cheap microphone because I can't afford a hundred pounds for a replacement Blue Yeti. Sorry. So we're just playing with this today. I'm sorry. Hopefully it's not too bad, but we, <laughs> we will see. It's just, it's this little thing. Anyway, we'll see. Um, but yeah, today we are doing three little projects. So the first one is gonna be my Natasha Denona Mini Star Palette. You guys know if you've been here before, I don't like this palette. I don't like this palette. I like these three shades. This blue is so lackluster and underwhelming and then my toner decided to just like completely ruin this gold shade. So we're gonna replace them too. Then we've got my Violet Voss Nicole Concilio palette and I wanna depot Boop Boop, which is this like sicky green color and also palm tree, which is like this green to brown duochrome. And then I thought one of the gold shades for the Natasha Denona might be Bronze Age from this palette because it is so beautiful and stunning. So yeah, we'll see. Um, We'll see how it goes. <laughs> but just before we jump into this video, if you have not already, definitely like and subscribe because it would mean the world to me. I do so many different kind of project pan, uh, depotting, repressing, shop my stash, bright, fun, colorful makeup kind of content. So if that sounds like a hoot to you, stick a round. Okay, let's, let's jump into this. I'm just realizing I didn't bring any towels up here. Probably should have done that. Okay, bear with one sec. <laughs> okay, I'm back with the kitchen roll and we're ready to rumble. So let's do this. Okay, so first things first, I'm gonna work with the Natasha Denona palette. Um, let's zoom you in a little bit. Okay, I'm hoping my audio is picking me up. I'm really sorry if there's gonna be like a few audio <laughs> things wrong in this video. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But here we are, this is my Natasha Denona Mini Star Palette. So I mentioned this shade got absolutely ruined by my toner just because it leaked all over my makeup bag and just got this one shade. So we all go, oh my God, look how hard this is. I'm putting, oh, you can see how I literally can't, oh my God. You can see how wrecked this shade is. We need to get rid right now. Oh my God. Oh, this is like ice hacking. Jeez. Ooh. And it's like all the way through the shadow as well. So like we can't save anything, unfortunately. Okay, that is it. That's kind of sad, I'm not gonna lie. It does make me feel a little bit sad, but it is all gone and it's going in the bin. It is. Ah! And it is also, when it focuses, that'd be great. <laughs> it is also time for this blue shade to say goodbye as well. Oh, this is so much easier. This is, yeah, you could see how easy that was <laughs> compared to that gold, but this shade, is the devil. Goodbye. I'm doing this because like I want to love this palette so much but I just don't and I want to be able to use it and love it. It's got loads of sentimental memories um, and so I want to use the palette. So this is what we're looking like right now. I'm gonna swatch these three shades and I'm gonna swatch this gold next to them. I don't know if that's 
too similar to this one, you know? It is a little bit more yellow, but I'm not sure about that. Okay, so I've done some swatching around and this is what we've kind of got. We've got a good wide range of different shades, but I think what I wanna put is this shade from my Sofex Revolution palette. Um, it's one of the golds. <laughs> there are so many golds in this palette that I don't really know which one's which, but I think this is the one we're gonna go with. You know what? I think we're gonna mix this shade and this shade, like a bit of both. So that's what we're gonna do right now. Okay, I think I'm good with this color. It's a little bit dark, but I think it will be okay. So I'm gonna go, maybe not with the circle one. I'm just gonna press that in. To be honest, there's really not much product in there, is there? I might just add the whole eyeshadow. There we go, I've just dumped the whole thing in there. I thought it would be a lot fuller than it was, clearly not. Hopefully this should be better. Okay, so that's our gold in, and now to find a blue. Okay, so how stunning and beautiful is this? This is the shade Beetle from the Pastel Roses. And this is just insane. Like it is so much more special than whatever that Natasha Denona shade was. I think the issue with the Natasha Denona shade is that it wasn't sparkly. Like this, it's not like blue in your face, but it's so shimmery and it gives so much texture and I think that's what was missing. So I'm gonna add this in here. So you can even see, it's just stunning. This does hurt my heart a little bit because oh I love the pastel roses so much and like I feel like I'm sacrificing this poor baby so that's in I'm gonna do it bit by bit just because I don't want to overload it I'm already loving this way more than the one before I'm so happy I decided to do this oh my god okay let's add the rest in Okay, and this is my new Natasha Denona mini star palette. How cute, oh my God, I love it. Um, This is what my poor beetle looks like. I wonder if I can kind of repress it a little bit sturdier. I don't wanna waste any of this, that's the thing. So I've managed to repress Beetle a little bit better so it doesn't look like it's, you know, been scraped out. <laughs> I'm happy with that. Okay. So yeah, this is my little Natasha Denona. I'm so happy. I feel like I'm gonna use this so much more now. All right then, moving on to the Violet Voss Nicole Concilio palette. We have Boop Boop here and Palm Tree here that we want to depot. So that's what I'm gonna do. There's just something about this shade that is so unique and so beautiful, I could not let it go.
comes out just like that. It already has binders in the eyeshadow, so it should be fine. Um, I have repressed multiple things like that before and it's all been fine. And now for palm tree. So I feel like I can get rid of the um, Violet Voss palette just because now these two shades, which were the ones that I loved, have been saved. So with that being said, this bad boy can go. All right, that's where I'm gonna leave it. I know I did say that I was gonna take the gold out of this palette, but I just didn't, I didn't like it. I didn't like it that much, I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, these are the four little things that we did today. I'm very, very excited. I'm glad that I've saved them. I'm so happy about the Natasha Denona. You have no idea. Um, I hope the audio wasn't too bad. I'm so gutted. If anyone has any experience or knows anyone with experience with fixing microphones, please let me know because I'm really sad. I'm really, really sad that, like, I really loved that mic and it cost a lot of money and now I can't use it. Um, so yeah, hit me up on Instagram if you know anyone. Um, I would greatly appreciate it. But this is where I'm gonna love you and leave you guys. If you did have a good time, definitely like and subscribe because it would mean the world to me. I do so many project pans, shop my stashes, and I do repressing videos from time to time. So definitely stick around and subscribe. I hope you have an incredible day and I will see you in the next video. Bye!